this is the HTC My Touch 4G and in this video we're going to show you how to take apart the phone so you can make various repairs. The first thing you need to do is remove the back cover from the phone, the battery and the SIM card and memory card if you haven't already done so. Next, using a Torx 5 screwdriver available on the repairsuniverse.com website, remove the two screws as being shown here now in the video. Next, remove the small Phillips screw as shown. Next, using a safe open pry tool, release the clips along the edges of the phone and then remove the back frame. Next, using the T5 Torx screwdriver, remove four more T5 screws as being pointed out here now. Using a safe open pry tool, release the bottom cover. Next we need to release the free button flex cables as being pointed out here now in the video. This can be eased off using a small screwdriver or safe open pry tool. Using a safe open pry tool, run it along the edges, releasing the clips as you go along. Once all the clips are released, you can remove the frame from the rest of the phone. Using a small screwdriver or safe open pry tool, release the power button flex cable. Using a safe open pry tool, release the pop connector as being shown now in the video. Next release the pop connector on the bottom part of the motherboard. With the ribbons released, start to release the clips that are holding the motherboard in place. Lift out the vibrator motor if you haven't already done so. You can use a safe pry tool just to ease this out. With the clips released, you can ease the motherboard off to the side, being careful as it is still connected with one ribbon cable underneath. Next, using a safe open pry tool, release the jaw clip as being shown here now in the video. With the jaw clip open, you can now ease out the ribbon cable by gently pulling apart.
With the last ribbon disconnected, you can now remove the motherboard section from the rest of the phone. Next, using a hot hair dryer or heat gun, heat the front of the screen to warm the adhesive which is holding the glass screen in place. With the glue warmed, you can now run a safer open pry tool around the sides of the phone and start lifting up the glass touchscreen. You may need to warm the top section again before being able to remove. Lift the glass out and place above the phone as it is still held in with a ribbon cable. Before we can release the cable, we need to remove the LCD screen. To do this, turn the screen over and heat the back to warm the adhesive which is holding the LCD in place. With the glue warmed, we can then gently lift the LCD screen out using a safe open pry tool. We can then ease the digitizer ribbon out from the frame. You can now replace the touchscreen digitizer or the LCD screen. 